Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to host your bot 24-7 for free. So now, let's hope into the video. Uh. Alright guys, so I will be using a Dynox in this video. I already made a couple videos on hosting, but this one I'll be using Dynox. So, Dynos have a pretty cool uh, website over here. You can check it out. I'll be leaving all of the links in the video in the description. Alright, there is here, uh, they hold Discord.js, Discord.py, Java, Go, those stuff. They offer uh, 250 megabytes of RAM, 2 gig of disk, and 50% of CPU for free plan. And they are planning on making a paid plan that have those specs. You can check them out later when they come out. So, um, they have a Discord server as well. You can check it out if you want to. Everything will be in the description. So, to start hosting, you're gonna need to go to client.dynox.us to sign up first, all right? So, once you join, you can, you can see something like this, all right? This is your password, all right? You need to save it somewhere uh, safe here, and that's your username. Also, you can log in using your email and that's an alt, so I don't care. You can see it. All right, here, username, password, keep it in play a safe place. All right, and now I'm able to press on close here, and I'll be here in the same place. So first of all, I need to create a server. So I can make the server less than 250 uh, megabyte and less than those, but since I only can create one server per user, so I'm gonna use all of them. All right, so I'm gonna just need this Dynox test. All right, location, there, there is only Paris right now, so I'm gonna choose it. Uh, I'm gonna choose uh, node.js for discord.js, rams, I'm gonna just choose the maximum, all right, and disk the same uh, CPU 50% because that's the maximum. I'm gonna hit create. All right, so uh, once you've done those steps, you're gonna need to go to uh, panel, all right, change client to panel. And it will ask you to log in, and that's normal. So I'm gonna get my username here, my password there, and you might be familiar with this uh, login panel since we used it in some host video. You can check it out. It's called Petro That word, all right. You can just log in. Pedro da Kelly, I, I, I don't know to be honest. I just don't care. I just want my bot to be hosted. It's software, by the way. All right, so now until it finishes installing, and that will take about from one to three minutes. All right, that's my bot uh, folder. All right, here. So, uh, all I want to do right now, I'm gonna zip it. All right. Uh, so I'm not gonna zip the folder, I'm gonna zip what is inside it. So I'm gonna do like this, right click, compress, alright? You maybe have a Windows, uh, so I'm gonna, you're gonna just do the same, right click and compress. It, it will also compress it, maybe using OAR or I don't know, but just compress it, alright? And here you go, just take this, close that, you don't need it anymore. Uh, or let this get over here, and now we'll just wait until this finish. Once it's finished installing, we're gonna be able to host our bot using uh, this. All right, so now it's done. I'm gonna open it, all right, and I'm gonna go to File Manager here. I'm gonna upload. Once I hit upload, I'm gonna just ch check for my uh, zip file that we just made. So that's it. I'm gonna open it. Alright, it's there. I'm gonna press on those three buttons and I'm gonna 
on our shiv or shiv i don't know how to call that too so uh, i will delete this one the zip file since we don't really need it all right so here we have our bot folder or files you can edit, edit them here if you want to like uh and uh, you can just upload again if you want to uh like have big changes and stuff just upload them again if you have like a small change you can just go over here just change what you want to change and done all right so let me check for my bot check if he was really online all right and there the bot is offline ultra x test v all right all right i had to stop recording and then come back right now so uh, as you can see with all the files, I'm gonna go check if the bot is offline. He is actually offline. Let me now go to the console. I'm gonna hit the stall button. You can also use uh, GitHub as I said before. So right now I'm gonna just wait a couple of seconds and then gonna work normally. And here we see it says Ultra X test V is online. Alright, let me check. As you can see, it's online. Also, if you want to use GitHub, here you're gonna put the link for your GitHub, the main branch, your main file, here your username, and here the Git token. If you don't know how to get the, the, the Git token, you just go to github.com slash settings slash tokens. Alright, and just create a new one let me just put my email all right once you create a new one you're gonna just mark this one use repo all right repo i'm just put the name and create one that's it so that was it for today's video i hope you enjoyed don't forget to like subscribe and do have a comment down below what you want the video to be that's it and ciao